When you first moved to L.A., I did not know this. You lived with roommates um, who were also trying to make in the business. Brad Pitt? Once upon a time in Hollywood, Brad Pitt lived with Jason Priestley. And as the Beverly Hills 90210 alum shares during the January 16th episode of Live with Kelly and Mark, Brad wasn't huge on hygiene back then. What's he like as a roommate, Brad Pitt? Um, uh, Brad was, Brad wasn't as bad as my other roommate, okay. who, was, who was an absolute disaster. Okay. Um, but Brad, Brad was okay. Um, but we used to play this game, uh, all of us, to see who could go the longest without showering. Which, I mean, I think about it now, and I'm like, dude, how disgusting. What, what were you thinking? Who, anyway. Who, who went the longest without Brad, showering? Brad, always Brad. <laughs> yeah. However, the 54-year-old notes that it's unlikely he's stuck with the same routine. I don't think he does that anymore, but back then, he, he could go a long time without showering. That, was, that's incredible. Yeah. yeah it was, well, you did your part for water conservation. Yeah. I did, exactly. That's, <laughs> that's what I'm really worried about. What was in the refrigerator in your apartment? Uh, beer. Okay. <laughs> water? <laughs> Maybe water. That's, that's the whole thing. Jason and Brad were roommates back in the 90s when they were both up-and-coming actors, living in a two-bedroom apartment located in what Jason calls the really crappy part of Los Angeles, alongside a third friend. In his 2015 memoir, Jason recalled that the pair were basically, quote, broke as they struggled to find acting work, noting, we lived on ramen noodles and generic beer the kind that came in white cans labeled beer and Marlboro Light cigarettes. After Jason was cast in Beverly Hills 90210 and Brad shot to fame in Thelma and Louise, the two lost contact. But still, Jason has nothing but great memories of the Oscar winner. In 2017, he told Huff Post, those were really fun days. Those friendships that we all formed and those times that we all had are times that I look back on fondly.